welcome back, guys, to another episode. And here we have Sebastian Padilla. Um, Sebastian, why don't you say your age, your grade, and what you're involved in SNL? Um, I'm 16, grade 11, and I go to chess club. Okay. And we're going to do Fast Five. And Fast Five is where I say five topics. And you just say the first thing that comes to your mind. So the first one is um, hobby. Video game. <laughs> Food. Oh, no, I, I really want some Benny Hanna's fried rice. Okay, okay, that's good. Um, TV show? Uh, I've been watching The Money Heist on Netflix recently. Mm-hmm. Um, the mo- a movie? Uh, Avengers Infinity War. And video game? Minecraft. Okay. So, for movie, you said Infinity War, right? Yeah. Or did you... S- okay. Uh, tell us why did you say that? He's got the penis. My grandma's here. Okay, we can wait. Um, it, uh, Infinity War because it popped up in my Netflix recommended the other day. So I started watching it and then, um, my parents started watching it last night so I I drove in so it's in the mind Ah. and you know it is my favorite Marvel movie or at least the best one why do you think it's the best one I think because it kind of it it like set a new standard for movies or it has everybody coming together but it doesn't have them winning you know there's (laughs) it's it's a very in-depth movie and it's not like your classic superhero coming together Mhm. Cuz they didn't win, right? Well, I mean in the end, but like in that movie specifically. Yeah. Do that's you what, yes. oh. Sorry, well, go ahead. <laughs> well, I mean, that's why I kind of feel bad when people like say Endgame is their favorite or the best, and I think Endgame is an is an audience movie and it is entertaining to watch, but I don't think it was the best crafted like Infinity War was. Why? Well, I mean, the the battle at the end, it was cool to see, but it was a little cheesy and mm-hmm. cliche, you know? Yeah. But that doesn't mean Endgame isn't fun to watch. Mm-hmm. Uh, do you have Maybe. a favorite Avenger or favorite character? Um, well, Tony Stark. Uh, why? He's, well, he's been my favorite since the Iron Man movie came out. Just because, you know, I like his his personality and his attitude and, you know, the suit doesn't take away from that. Just okay. makes him even cooler. <laughs> Do you look up to him or no? I don't. I don't really look up to. No, not really. Okay. Um. So, if you were to fulfill a character's shoes in Infinity War, would you want to replace Iron Man or Tony Stark, or would you? No, replace I don't want to be in Infinity War. That's oh, <laughs> really stressful. I know, but <laughs> I don't know. It's just a question. So you wouldn't want to be part of a movie? Not even, like... If I had to, I would be, like, Thor or... <laughs> or maybe even Ebony Ma, just because he has... He's all-powerful. Just one of the guys, like, you know, is not going to die. Okay. Even though, even though Ebony Ma died, I <laughs> could still have his powers. That would be cool. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, do you have a least favorite Avenger? I say Captain America. Really? Why? He's he's just boring. <laughs> he's, he's just a better human, but, but that's not. <laughs> Are you nothing, saying? The only thing about him that is special is just being better, just being stronger than everybody else. <laughs> that's that's it. So you're saying he doesn't add to the team, or what? <laughs> no, I think he he adds, but. I'm just saying he's he's my least favorite just because he's boring. <laughs> like anybody can be strong. I guess okay. Maybe not, maybe not that strong, but it's not like he's as strong as the Hulk, right? You're right. Okay. <laughs> so you're saying he's nothing without his strength, basically. I know. Without his what? Strength. 
string strength not string. oh no <laughs> i'm not saying that i'm just saying there's nothing that like really that makes him unique okay really other than at least on the outside that <laughs> yeah. he can actually like help in a fight so i think because like half of the team is strong mm-hmm. like it is stronger than average so him being able to run faster and punch a little harder isn't that new and he doesn't <laughs> bring much to the table on the battlefield. Okay. So. Um mm-mm. so did once you saw like did you like not like Captain America when you saw the movies or did you read the comics or what? Well I mean I think the Captain America movies are good. Except for the first one. I didn't really like the first one. <laughs> I liked Winter Soldier though. That was that was gonna be one of my favorite Marvel movies. Even though Captain America's in it, but it's it's, it's just like the mystery. It, it mainly for the Winter Soldier, and mm-hmm. and the mystery, and I think like the like the truths and like the the moral decisions is. So, if you could have any superpower, would you want like like what would you want? Would you still want to have what? I would yes. want flight. Flight. Yes. Why? Because I could go anywhere. <laughs> and I could go fast. Yeah, I, I could go anywhere. That's okay. basically why I need freedom. Okay, so I'm where trapped. would you go if you could fly? <laughs> I don't know. I just want the option to. Oh, uh, okay. Right? And then it, it's also a fast way of transportation. So I could save so much money on gas while helping the environment. Okay, okay. <laughs> so would you, like, go to school flying or something? Yeah. <laughs> I could be even later than I do now, <laughs> and still be late. Wow, would you? So you would never use a car again after that? Why? Well, I mean, unless I had to keep it a secret, but I don't know why. Would you want like a costume or no? No. <laughs> I probably would need something so I don't suffocate if I fly high. Yeah. But that's well, about it. But why would you fly high? I don't know. Maybe you want to go to Mount Everest. Okay. I don't know. Well, so yeah. So you want to travel or do you just like the idea of traveling? Well, I just like the idea of flying. Okay. I don't have to worry about falling anymore. You could still fall. No, I'll catch myself with flying. Yeah, but maybe you won't. I don't know. If not flight, then teleportation. Oh, okay, okay. Mm, well, I feel like teleportation would be better, but I don't know. <laughs> well, yeah, but flying, you can do all the things of teleportation, but you still take time. Yeah. I feel like, I don't know. Why am I talking about what I think? This is about you. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. No. Um, is there a superpower that you would not want? Like, if you got it, you would hit yourself forever, kind of thing. <laughs> mm, seeing the future, probably. Oh. Or so reading you other people's minds. So you wouldn't use it ever, I'm assuming. Well, I probably would use it, but I wouldn't. I'm going to say, if I could choose one to definitely not have, it would probably be one of those. Okay. Uh, Going back to flying, would you ever use it for good or would you just use it as a convenience well, like would you <laughs> like would you want to be a superhero or not <laughs> no i wouldn't want to be a superhero just because no. that's that's too much pressure <laughs> and you know we have people for that so it's not like there's any intergalactic threats <laughs> it's, it's not like flying is going to be um Bye, everybody. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Link down below. (laughs) All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Um, We'll see you next week with another episode. Bye.